Hi, I'm Mike Santora, Associate Editor for Design World Magazine and Make Parts Fast. Today I'm here with Frank Marangel from Big Rep. Frank, thanks for being with us. Mike, it's our pleasure. Thanks for coming by the booth. Well, thank you. Okay, so tell me a little bit about what you're focusing at the show this year and how the technology is going to be able to help design engineers. Sure, sure. So we introduced a new machine on Monday that we're showing for the first time globally, which is the new studio, the Studio Gen 2. So we're actually improving on the steady standard big rep studio that is in the market today. And what this machine is doing is totally being enclosed with enclosed filament cabinet with new extruding nozzle and some new characteristics like uh, semi-automatic bed leveling. But the goal of that is to run engineering materials. And that's really what big rep is all about, focusing on applications and the material that it's needed to run the application. Any company could close in a machine and, and then run better engineering materials. Mm -hmm. this, this machine is a lot more than that. It actually has a very unique, innovative extrusion technology, one that we dub MXT or metering extruder. So instead of drooling and drawing like a standard extruding technology, the MXT actually separates the thermal process from the depositing process. So we extrude into a hot end into a thermal pool, and then we use a positive displacement pump, shrunk down the size of 3D printing extruding system, that's the unique characteristics that we patented, and then deposit, is, deposit the exact amount of material in the right location at the right time, allowing us to go faster with more geometric accuracy, with a lot more repeatability. So you get better Z strength, better geometric accuracy, and about five to 10 times faster than a standard extrusion machine today. Now the materials, you mentioned them earlier. Can you talk a yeah. little bit more specifically about the materials? Yes. Uh, our readership base uh, always has a lot of questions about that. Sure. What developments we're seeing um, right now, especially from Big Rep, yeah. and what do you think you will see happening down the line maybe the next year or so with materials? Yes, yeah, so uh, there are two ways that people think about material, either closed or open. Big Rep kind of gets in the middle of both of those, meaning that we sell big rep materials and we certify these materials and we have programs that allow you to use that material like a plug and play. So you just pop it in the machine, put the program in and run it. But we're also open to third party materials. So any customer that wants to put a, their own material or some other material in that we didn't already certify has the option to do that. We don't void any kind of warranty. We actually have a lot of settings on the machine that allow you to adjust that to work perfectly for those materials. And we actually learn from our customers that way also what materials they want to run. So it's kind of a partnership. Now, Big Rep really focuses on applications. So when I talk about materials, they're, they're what engineers want to run most typical. So it's the, the nylons and, and it's the ABSs and ASAs and the carbon filled and uh, fiber filled versions of all of those, some ESD materials. We don't sell all of those ourselves, but those are materials that we expect to run on this machine. Okay. Well, Frank, that's a lot of great information. Thank you so much. Can you tell everybody where they can find out more about Big Rep online? Yeah, thanks for asking, Mike. So uh, we are at bigrep.com, and you can see us on all the social media locations, Twitter, Facebook, LinkedIn as well. Okay, wonderful. Okay. And of course, for more videos like this, you can always go to designworldonline.com.